In this lesson, you will learn how to determine whether a parabola opens upward or downward for a quadratic function given in standard form, vertex form, and factored form. When a quadratic function is given in standard form, if a is greater than zero, the parabola opens upward. If a is less than zero, the parabola opens downward. For the first function, a is three, which is greater than zero, so the parabola opens upward. For the second function, a is negative one, which is less than zero, so the parabola opens downward. When a quadratic function is given in vertex form, again, you need to focus on the sign of a. If a is greater than zero, the parabola opens upward. If a is less than zero, the parabola opens downward. For the first function, a is one, which is greater than zero, so the parabola opens upward. For the second function, a is negative two, which is less than zero, so the parabola opens downward. When a quadratic function is given in factored form, again, you need to focus on the sign of a. If a is greater than zero, the parabola opens upward. If a is less than zero, the parabola opens downward. For the first function, a is four, which is greater than zero, so the parabola opens upward. For the second function, a is negative one, which is less than zero, so the parabola opens downward. That's it for this video. If you want to learn how to find the vertex and the axis of symmetry of a parabola, please check the link in the description. Thanks for watching.